a retired Sergeant First Class in the United States Army. He was in 19 and a half years. Uh, enjoyed every minute of it. You know, and it's uh, very different now that I'm out. Uh, so, you know, just learning the difference between living on the, in, the military and then out on the outside. You know, I've been, I was like, what, 20 years old when I came in, so. Now, how exciting was it for you to run out of the tunnel for the first time after, you know, however many years? Oh, that was awesome. I tell you what, I was all pumped up, you know, and uh, first time, you know, it, I, I was tired, but you know what, I'll get better, you know, but uh, best part, I didn't fall down, so. And how's the Wounded Warrior Project and, and the, and how's that affected your life and how's your recovery been since um, since you were out in military service? Well, they do a lot of good things for you, you know. Um, anything to get you out of the house. Uh, uh, we recently, back in the summer, we did, uh, for the whole family, it was horseback riding, you know. I uh, went to the Children's Museum. Uh, actually, next weekend, I think it is, we're going down to the, the uh, parade down there, you know. But uh, just getting you out there and doing stuff, I think it helps, you know, veterans a lot so how important it is to you for the military to be a part of Syracuse athletics especially the football team you know it gives that uh, extra special touch you know it gives that meeting you know brings them the community closer I think you know um, sometimes you know a lot, a lot of like say civilians you know sometimes don't like it when the military is around but I think what Syracuse University is doing you know, with Fort Drum is you know a great thing so